Hello and welcome back to more Spider-Man 2 here on the PlayStation 5, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me once again to continue this playthrough. It has been such a blast. I hope you all have been enjoying it as well, too. When we last left off, we did a little adventure with Miles, uh, got some skill points, uh, did a little side quest. Um, but now it is time to continue on with the main story. I open up the app. Uh, healing the world is still the main mission, and we have to be Peter for that. So we're going to go ahead and switch over to Peter right now. Pete's touring that new foundation in the city. Let's get to it. <laughs> this cool little hey, Pete, friend scene. Ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that Yang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader, some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Huh. thought the police would have impounded all this by now. Main mission available. Swipe left to access the main mission. Does it say 24 tech parts? I guess, uh, I guess it does require like 200 plus for some of these skills. I'm already on it. Chief Clark, go. everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely! Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Oh, that's that new uh, corner web swinging ability. It uh, turns you on a dime. It's pretty good. There are a lot of different side quests now. That one looked like to be some sort of uh, like a fire emergency side quest as well, too. Lots of opportunities to earn all these different types of points and things they want you to use for all these upgrades. Wow. I was wondering what this place was. Emily's tree. Oh, this is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this, but my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him... Decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you? I got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment. But when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? 
Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission, to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees, or to be more precise, on bee predators. Bee predators? Yes, Gene, I just checked in on Dan and Annie. Like, I feel like this is a sign of things to come, but I, I'm not sure what, what bees are gonna do. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Dang, she pulled up like a steam deck. Oh, cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Okay, so the triggers are to rise and descend and then R1 or squares to fire. You, there are so many mini games in this game. It's so cool. Oh, nice. I'm trying to get pretty good accuracy yes. here. Yep. Ideally, oh, yeah. I'd want a hundred percent. Gotta protect the hive. Luckily, nice. they're not really moving. Gotcha. I don't want to shoot that just quite yet because I'm not sure. Wow. Is ten. I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be. Good Although it does kind of look like it's homing in a little bit. Business. I'm getting the hang of this. Let's see. I knew you'd be good at this. I'm in business. Not the bee puns. <laughs> Two more. Here we go. Okay, but there was a lot to get, though. There it is. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Keep thinking those are real bees. Welcome to entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Text now, up ahead miles. is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Hmm. 
So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. All right. So, yeah, one of those uh, how long has time passed kind of moments, because in the previous games, he was not the lizard. He was nowhere near close to becoming the lizard. I think so it was hinted at just see. a little bit, but Where do I even start? it's kind of crazy now that he is like just straight up the lizard. And not only do people know about it, but they're kind of OK nice. with it. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Mm. Okay, so we already went through. Well, obviously they 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 gave him a villain bad like a villain name. This is the original prototype. There's a bad guy lab. name. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Noticing all these different icons that I thought were going to be mini games, but it looks like it's just uh, kind of indicators for the origins of different life things. on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Hint towards Venom's origin, perhaps? Oh, wow. This place is insane. So this is the Emily May Foundation, named after both Harry's mom. Oh, <laughs> Harry's mom and uh, Peter's Aunt May. Uh, I remember Harry being really into environmentalism. I should explore as much as I can right now. Ooh, let me get out then. Uh, and so, yeah, for him to have gone and built this gigantic thing, also in kind of, you know, as a memorial here every day. to his Someone mom and to Aunt May's. Start paying off the mortgage. So nice. Uh, what if Spidey work gets in the way? Gotta think this through before signing on. Can we feed the fish? Yeah, you can't feed the fish. I thought it was just to give me some information about them. Cool fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. So cool. Couldn't have said it better myself, man. May would have loved this place. Let's keep looking around here before taking one of the elevators up. This looks to be maybe the entrance. Oh, yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. All right, so going up stairs triggered that, but it is not leading me upstairs. I have a mission marker now that is down here maybe this maybe those were the stairs i was supposed to go into uh talk to dr nguyen hey. or nugen what are you doing with these bikes we're working on ultra efficient batteries charged by bicycles these bikes can i ride them not right now but when they're road ready we'll need people to test them nice i'll try to come back I was for sure thinking that I was getting ready to do another biking mini game, which was actually, it wasn't really a mini game. It was just like a way to travel. Yeah, I was still really excited about it. Uh, entomology, elevators. I went to space ish, went there. All right, let's go meet Harry and see what the rest of this building has to offer. Particle accelerator. Every time I see that, the only thing I think of is the flash. Sometimes, like, <laughs> sometimes I wish the line between different uh, franchises would blur just a little bit. It would be so, so cool for a small flash mention, but obviously that's so never going to happen. Explore. But I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. Reports from the agricultural lab? These doors don't open. I'm starting to think I'm pretty oh, much, right. sorry about that, got everything. And it's looking like it. Yes, 
So many unique and interesting NPC interactions. It is very much reminding me of Grand Theft Auto V, and I adore that. I've always loved how lifelike and how just... What is that noise? Uh, I just loved how real and how active the world felt, and, and this is making me feel that all over again as well, too. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Please. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. I wonder if he would have brought up the fish thing if I didn't actually go to the... Uh, to feed the fish. Algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for understanding. See you soon. This way, Duke. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Uh, hybrid calibration. To incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. So grab hex genes and place them into empty slots. Uh, so looking at this, I think it's going to be like this. You want to create little links. So I'm linking up these uh, the four lines here, like that. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Hex genes have attributes that impact the plant. Um, uh, well, let's take a look and see. I don't see any of these yellow lines here, so it's probably not going to be that. I do see a couple of these green lines right here that link up right there. Uh, but I don't let's think that's going to do it either. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with this. This is going to be a little trial and error -y, unless I just get it right here. Let's take a look. Did that do it? Nice. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Okay, you can move them around too and kind of place them so you can finagle it a little bit. So I need to use five of the six and I need to use at least one plant sun and one water. 
<laughs> I think if I start here, I can attach the sun here. Let's go ahead and attach that, and then this, and then that. Beautiful work, Peter. So it's not that difficult of a mini game. Not like the the lines one from uh, from the first Spider-Man game. We had to like Using subtract and add. We're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow, I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. I don't know, Peter, you just lost your job, man. This might not be a bad idea. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and May proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Well, might as well take a look at it after I check out some of these uh, new abilities uh, that I can get. I don't think I unlocked any new suits. It, it said that a new suit was affordable. That is new, though. I don't remember having this Brooklyn 2099 uh, suit unlocked before. That looks pretty sick actually though it's one of those suits though that it, for me i don't know some of the suits are a bit too involved like this is just the right amount of involved 
this might be a little bit much. And this, of course, is, well, it's very Robin-y, but I kind of dig it. I don't know. I may use it at some point. All right, skills. Let's take a look. I still don't have this side unlocked for Peter. Probably has something to do with, uh, <laughs> with, with Venom. Um, spider dash. Oh, nice. You can do one of the little dashes while flying or, gl or, or swinging. A spider jump. Wow, you get pretty good distance. That's almost similar to the uh, to the electro move during the chase scene. I think what I'm gonna do combo resupply, parry disarm. I do like the ability to traverse so much. I, the swinging in this game is so fun. Free venom dash. Uh, it's... Yeah. I think I'm going to go ahead and get, let's go ahead and get the spider dash and then just hope I can remember it <laughs> whenever, whatever it happens. But they already both swing pretty quick, if I'm being honest. No more skill points. Uh, let me see if I can take a look at some of these. Nothing else for him. Spider Barrage is just Spider Barrage. Spider Rush is still the same. And Whiplash still the same. All right. So let's take a look at one of these things that Harry has linked to us. Maybe hey, I can look sorry, it up on the app. Uh, or maybe not. I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... It's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Kinky and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Let us see it on the map. That would be the mission that I just got. Bad guys on the block. Let me see. Uh, Marco's memories, photo ops, the flame, EMF experiments. Here we go. A little Tokyo plant science. So we'll do one of these and we'll see what it's all about. And see what kind of points it unlocks for us. As far as I can tell, though, most of these things are just going to unlock tech points. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and East is going to send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May's stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... everything. This isn't Feast, is it? it kind of looks like the front door of Feast. Sorry, MJ. You've got my full attention now. Go ahead. Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is going to send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May's stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... everything. I'll call... Oh, it keeps interrupting because I get I get really close to this. Okay, uh, I'm. This is so awkward and weird, but I'm gonna finish this cutscene. If she calls Foster back again. Mind if Spider-Man helps Peter out. But it looks like that also might be the end of the call. All right, it's the end of the call. Let's uh, let's do it. <laughs> Use my key card. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. Are we doing a little bit of gardening? Also, I'm pretty sure this is uh, this is the feast mm. building. Where am I looking here for samples, though? Uh, oh, I see some vines and stuff right here. Maybe I'm supposed to 
follow them this way. Here's one. Select that. This one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. And it looks like this one is growing down this way on the other side of it. Whoa! Other side of this wall. This one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. Yeah. Whip, 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 whip. Can I collect it from here? Not quite. These are clearly more efficient with water. I can use that. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. Let's do our little mini game again. The EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. Nice. They give you a little jumping off point. All right. So we want at least one of these, both of the plants, and then it doesn't really matter what the other ones are. So just looking at some quick. Let's see. Kind of connections here. I know I definitely need to put this one, but it doesn't go there. Uh, I need a two. Okay. So maybe not this. Maybe that. Wait to see this grow. Hmm. Not like that. Okay. So this is a little bit more complicated than I thought it was going to be, but we can do this. Hmm. Maybe if I add the sun here instead. If this works, these plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. Hmm. Let me try something else. Let me add this here. One of those. I got it. Perfect. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just got to get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. Oh, we are really doing a farming sim now. Yeah, I just got to patch this up. Where am I going? Some webs should do the trick. Web leaks to restore pressure. Just like that. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Ooh, and we have to move stuff around too in order to do it as well. Those boxes. A few more to patch up. I think there's one up here. There it is. Oop. Would be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. There's more than I thought. Last one. May used to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs? No, I hear... I hear another one. I'm pretty sure. Here it is. I would be all the way down there. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. Complete all EMF experiments to unlock a new suit. Is it weird that I would be really hoping for like some, some environmental green Spider-Man suit? 